Hello and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing well. So this is part four of Ziggy and you guys are joining us on a good day because it is Winterfest. I'm going to try to have him do a few Winterfest activities but first let's see if we can check our mailbox for gifts. I don't know if anybody gave a Ziggy anything but that would be very nice if they did oh okay so Beatrice gave us the bladder games I don't know what that is but I oh it's a book okay I just want to see how much it was worth that's pretty nice I'm gonna keep the book because it was a gift this area has become littered with so much stuff Duh, because of Beatrice. She's been making these. He's got a cross stitch that he needs to finish. So let's resume our large cheese hoop. We only have $8. So he's kind of got to finish this so that we can do a yard sale and get some more money. And we're just going to sit over here by all these, <laughs> all these de-stress concoctions and this dirty pan over here, which I'll have him clean up when he's done. But he is looking adorable in his winter outfit. I do want to give Beatrice a gift since she gave us one. So maybe after we're done with this and we clean up, we can meet with Beatrice and do a little gift exchange. And like just hopefully Santa visits us. And he didn't have a good harvest fest, so hopefully he has a good winter fest. So we're done with this. Let's start cleaning up. Where'd you go? All right, Ziggy, let's start this sale. Let's put our cross stitch in here. All right, people, let's go. What is it marked at? Let's go back to 300%. Okay, Beatrice is pursuing a new job. That's cool. All right, friends, let's give you some pitches and get these or get this one cross stitch sold. Who doesn't want a huge block of cheese? So she wants to get to know Dennis Kim. Why not? The more friends, the better. She's taking a selfie. Cecilia, you've bought plenty from us before. Don't you want this one to add to your collection? Oh, somebody bought it for $712. That is a steal of a deal. So while he's in a great mood, let's knock some more of these out. Let's do some phrases. I don't know that we've ever done Larry the Lobster, so let's do that. He is hungry and needs to use the restroom, so we'll do that here soon. Oh, okay, and now we've got everybody in our bedroom. I, I need to get him a living room because there's really no place for everybody to hang out without just crowding him in his bed, which is bizarre. Well, he's got a stove now, but I'm terrified of him, or he's got an oven, but I'm kind of terrified of him making a grand meal, but I think we should just do it. It's Christmas or Winterfest, so let's do it. Yes, he just hurt himself. I think he chopped his finger and he just dumped that in his food. So this is gonna be a mess but that's okay <gasps> she's got a special gift for us she keeps giving us gifts she's so sweet invite her in and then you've got to resume your cooking she gave us a pizza y'all that is so funny Beatrice is like I know you don't know how to cook so I'm gonna give you a pizza that is so sweet Beatrice I'm going to have him eat his grand meal for now just so that he can cross that off his wish list. But you are more than welcome to stay and eat with us. All right, so he is done eating. Let's exchange friendship bracelets. We've had this in our inventory for so long and I've wanted to give it to her for a while. Mm, they're having their special moment. That's cute. We love it. All right, now my friend needs to put this in his fridge. Can we put this in there? Awesome. Let's clean up and get back to work. Let's make some nature mushrooms. You can join us, Beatrice, if you want to. So did he finish this one? He didn't. I'll have him finish. Wait, 
Oh, he poked his finger. That's fine. So while his finger is poked and he doesn't want to crochet anymore, I think we should start a garden. A nice spot would be over here by Frank. So let's open up these seed packets. What is it? It's winter. Let's open the winter ones. <gasps> Father Winter is here. You guys, I didn't even know it was 9 p.m. But let's introduce ourselves to Father Winter and see if he'll give us a nice gift. If it's something we don't need, we can either give it to someone or we can sell it. He's over here cooking on our grill. Santa, please just give me a present. You don't have to cook. He gave us a sapphire. That's cool, but uh, let's see, how much is it worth? 18 bucks. I'm actually gonna give that to our crystal person. I'm gonna put this over here for them. Ziggy, what's wrong, Ziggy? You're bored of Santa? Well, that's just not nice. He gave you something, even though you don't need it. He made your winter very nice, your winter fest very nice. So when he comes out, we need to finish our Larry the Lobster, and we also need to finish this mushroom hoop. I guess I'll have him do one more, or try to do one more, and then go to sleep. Let's do another phrase. A large hoop derby. Let's do that. Great, we had a successful winter fest. He poked himself, so I'm just gonna send him to sleep. All right, Ziggy's awake. He's going to use the restroom and then eat something. I really wanna get this garden started. So I, I will do that before I do anything else. So let's plant these. I don't know why he's struggling to do the potatoes, but let's plant these. He can like gardening. What's up, Beatrice? Her and Dennis Kim had a great time. We acquired the gardening skill, which is always great. Let's go. So Frank over here is very lucky because we gave him a bunch of seed packets. We're starting his garden. Maybe we'll get him next. I don't know. I'm really, I'm really excited to play with all of them at this point. Plant potatoes. And now I'm going to have him resume his hoops. Now that we got one mission accomplished. That one's worth 168. Now resume this one. Sorry Beatrice, I can't hang out right now. I've got to finish some of this cross stitching work. And it never fails. Every time we want to have a sale, this happens. So I'm just going to throw these packets over here. If the seasons change and I'm still playing with Ziggy, then I don't mind opening them and adding to the garden, but there's no point in keeping them in my inventory when I don't need them. And I don't wanna sell it for money. So he's done. These should get us a little bit of money. I'm torn. Should we cross stitch some more? Or does his finger hurt? No, he's just uncomfortable. So let's go here, change out of your wet clothes and keep on cross stitching. These large ones make a lot of money. So that's what I'm focusing on as long as we have the money. So he only has 45 simoleons left. That's okay. We'll have a sale after this. It's looking pretty cute so far. Be careful Ziggy. I think he finished. And we're just cleaning cleaning up. We have a water leak in our place. So I'm gonna have to have him fix everything that's broken. Unfortunately. But he is getting his handiness skill up, so that is good. That's a bonus. Clean up. Alright. We just got a hundred and three dollars for helping our landlord clean up they sent us money so that's nice actually i can make another cross stitch medium hoop would be cool i'll cross stitch this image of his bed it's random but i'm curious if it will sell for more or not if it's just the same amount or if it's even worth doing cross stitch from reference 
he's done so we're gonna scavenge for parts and then throw that away let's take care of our needs and have a yard sale that's worth 125 and that's worth 205 so yeah our reference maybe because it was a medium stitch yeah it was a medium stitch so actually it'll be worth more probably more than the other ones if I did it on a large hoop I'm gonna sell I'm gonna sell all this scavenged parts that we don't need get some leftovers and we'll have him stock the table these all look really good now they are marked up high so it's probably gonna be slow going here but I mean he is an expert these should go for 300% markup oh see $816 that was probably the most we've ever gotten on a cross stitch okay so people are not minding the 300% markup for some reason the sell is going easier than others maybe it's his charisma I don't know but we only have two more. Thank you, Beatrice, for buying Yamachan. That was so nice of her. Now we just have... Oh! And that one sold really quick. Awesome. Thank you. So, I actually am going to do some more house renovations. And I'm going to see what we get. Alright, so this is what we have for Ziggy so far. He will need to do some more cross stitching because I want to get him like a TV entertainment system over here. And I want to be able to add some pictures. And then he still needs a kitchen sink. So we're not quite there just yet, but we're close. And I do want to do a little bit more in the bathroom, like maybe put a hamper in here or something to hold towels maybe like a floor rug and a towel hanging rack like there's definitely a lot of things that Ziggy still needs so let us get started hmm let's do nature let's make another pumpkin I'm glad we do have a couch now so that if people want to hang out with us, they can hang out with us on our couch and visit with us. I'm really liking this extra space we've got. He actually went out there to hang out. I don't, <laughs> I think that's cool. I don't know why, but he, is he just going to keep going back and forth? Weird. Well, let's scavenge for parts and then throw this away. Did he finish his cross stitch already? No. So we need to resume that. Mood lit here. He's exhausted. So we'll probably have to get him some sleep before he has this sale. Let's just delete that. Upgrade parts we don't need. Everyone's leaving. Except for Beatrice, they're just chilling. I think we can do it in this episode. I think we can finish his place. So I'm gonna send him to sleep and then we're gonna wake up and have our sale. Let's go ahead and stock this table. Oh, he still had one in there. That's weird. So we have two. What's up, Beatrice? She wants a new job. Follow your heart, my girl. So we actually have two. I guess I never sold his cross stitch from reference yet all right where is everybody it is like so snowy and pretty out here all right our normal customers are here that is a good sign let's give some sales pitches and oh oh my gosh y'all that sold in record timing what i didn't even really get started well that's not quite enough to get everything that I want done to his humble abode. 
So let's go stitch some more. Let's do a dog's welcome Sims tolerated large cross stitch. Why do we keep getting scavenged parts? Does something keep, is there a glitch going on? I do not know what's happening. Oh my gosh, there's a fire. Somebody, oh, oh. Okay, so this guy over here, let's extinguish him. He, please get to him in time, Ziggy. Ziggy, no, 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 no. Just go extinguish him. Help, 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 help. Okay, so he just ruined our grill, but we saved his life and we got 260 for the insurance, but I'm sure it cost more. $650? Yeah, it does cost way too much, so we're not gonna do that right now. Well, if we have... Can we sell this? Let's go sell all these flowers so that we can maybe replace that. Why is she selling our flowers? What? Did she just steal our flowers? <gasps> Y'all. Um, that was weird. We were in the middle of selling these flowers and that woman just took them. Dude. Well, I'm gonna have to put a gate around these, but I really don't have time to do it right now. I'll have to do it later, but that was obnoxious. Get out of our house. I'm scared you're gonna steal our stuff. I'm trying to replace items that were burned down. Well, anyway, let's try to cross stitch and uh, carry on. We're really just trying to crank out um, the last of this episode. I'm so worried about everyone's stuff because that girl is like a thief or a klepto. Now I'm paranoid and thinking that everybody's stuff is going to get stolen before I can even play with them. I don't know. All right, let's talking more stitching. Scavenge. We need a lot of money now to replace that grill. Let's keep cross stitching because we are gonna need a lot. He'll just make a fitness hoop. I guess he went into his bedroom. Yeah. Just an old comfort spot of his to cross stitch on his bed. He does like to do that. So Ziggy looks like he's nauseous. Uh-oh, he's gonna probably throw up here in a minute. You all right, Ziggy? I guess he's fine. Let's finish that sell these parts and then when he's done he can just go to sleep so i will see you guys when he's ready to get on the seller's table so i am once again selling these flowers and potatoes so that i can go over here and repair this grill or replace the grill so i still think i'm in the hole a little bit but that's fine it's a sacrifice i'm willing to make should i put I'm going to put this in his inventory to protect it from other sims and keep them from doing all of this. Now let's go stock this table and start a yard sale. Same lady. Well, she just bought something, so maybe I can forgive her for stealing, but I'm just going to give some sales pitches. Yay. Thank you, Beatrice loyal customer all right we're all sold out this is just enough to get the tv that i want but not enough to do everything so maybe one or two more let's do a stitch from reference i'll just have him do his hanging plant just something random to do and then I'll pop back in when he's done so Ziggy is sick so he didn't end up finishing his project I'm gonna have him drink some orange juice and then we'll just take care of his needs so that he'll feel better maybe getting some sleep will help all right Ziggy is getting up and he's going to resume his cross stitch project and hopefully this sells for a good amount. I'm thinking maybe three more and he should have enough to finish off his house. That could be just a pipe dream, but I don't know. We'll find out. I hope he gets that expert stitcher movement. Okay, so he has it. We'll see if it does anything to help him not poke his fingers so much, but we'll see. 
All right, so Ziggy did finish that, so I'm gonna have him keep going. Let's make a large laugh love get to know hoop. And we're just powering through. So Ziggy doesn't feel very well and he needs a shower. So whenever he stops working on this hoop, we'll take care of his needs, drink some more orange juice. Um, he didn't have a good New Year's Eve, so he is not in the best of moods and he does need social. So he's got a lot going on. Let's get some leftovers. The Petri the Pizza Beatrice gave us. Let's get some orange juice. And then we'll use the restroom. I guess he went to use the pea bush. Is something wrong with your toilet? No. Rummage for bits and pieces. Now throw away. Just throw away the trash. Okay. Let's resume our cross stitch hoop. He wants to do it out here. The, it is actually a really pretty day and Beatrice is over here talking to us, making us feel better. Just chat about property value. All right, so she left. We finished that hoop. We just need one more, one more. Let's do another gnome. And then I guess I'll come sell this. Do I wanna sell this? I think I will just harvest harvest them and give these flowers to Frank. Did you already make it? You know, I don't know how he did it that fast, but I'm thinking what I will do is have him make another one because it can't hurt. It cannot hurt to cross stitch again. And then we'll have our sale. I don't know why our trash bin is over full, but it's fine. Let me dump these flowers. Frank Stem is gonna have a lot of work to do. <laughs> I kinda wanna play him next because he's gonna have a really good start. And I think he finished that hoop as well. No, he hurt his finger. That's fine. While we are waiting for his finger to stop hurting, we can sell the other ones. Yeah, so that's the one he needs to resume. I th so let's sell these three while we're waiting on his finger to stop hurting. He's got the single and loving it lifestyle, which is fine. He has been single this entire time. Ooh, we already sold one. Let's give you a sales pitch. Thank you, thank you so much. Yes, so by the time we're done with this, he should be able to cross stitch again. Yay, good timing. Let's end that, that was quick. Let's resume Ziggy. Wait, did we finish that one? I could have sold that one. I don't know why I didn't notice that. That's okay, he'll sell those other two at the same time and we will have plenty of money to finish his house. I'm so excited. All right, so we're done with cross stitching. I will sell this on this table. He's tired though, so hopefully this goes just as quickly as the other times. Is he tending the table? He is, but he has to go to the bathroom really bad. So I'm actually gonna let him do that. I don't know why he keeps going to the pea bush, but come back to your table. Oh, he wants to go to sleep. All right, so we'll just do the sale when he gets up and has something. So we're up and we need to take care of our needs and clean out our fridge. Let's get some good leftovers. I think his trash can is glitched out. So when I make over his house, I will fix that. You have a crush on George? I don't care. Go have fun. Beatrice always has a crush on somebody. She is not single and loving it. She is single and wanting to mingle. All right, when we're done with our turkey, we will get down to business. And just in time for bills and rent. Okay, one already sold. That is epic. And two sold. Yes, 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 we did. All right, so I'm gonna have him pay his bills and whatever's left 
then we will make over this house for the final, hopefully final time. All right, my friends, here is the final look at Ziggy's house. So this is the outside. It's pretty simple. I didn't have a lot of money to do much on the outside or even really the inside, but it's actually not bad. So let's just go on a little tour. So here we are in his living room. I was able to get the TV that I wanted and I gave him a little cat bed because he likes cats so I figured soon he'll want to get a cat and I put a little CC cat bowl down here for him as well. I got him this this table back here and I found some balls of yarn that I thought were pretty cute and I got him a thermostat and a microwave and this little decor over here. He finally has one of these stove overheads and this rack. So I did move the kitchen over here. The bathroom was over there, but um, it needed to be closer to the bedroom, I think. So let's go into his bedroom. So this is kind of an overhead view of his bedroom. Not much in here changed. I did put some shoes down there on the floor and I gave him this mid-century painting. He has a little dresser and this little yarn thing over here that I thought was cute. Now let's look at the bathroom. He's got a hamper now and he's got a bathrobe and a floor mat. And yeah, his house is is complete. It's not decorated as much as I wanted, but we only have like seven dollars left. <laughs> Ziggy spent everything that he had, and I don't think it's a bad spot to leave him at. So if you guys enjoyed Ziggy, let me know in the comments. He was actually pretty fun to play with once I got over the learning curve of how he was gonna actually earn money. And he does have his knitter bag back, so whenever he wants to do that, he can. In the next episode, we will spin for the third person in Tiny Town, and I am super excited. So I will see you all in the next video. Bye.